I'm not doing enough drifting. Is that the problem? Oh, fuck! Hello and welcome, Yoshi players, to Crash Team Racing on the original PlayStation 1. Now, I realize it has, once again, been a while since I did some gameplay videos. The last time I did it was when I did the Mario Kart Wii video where I faced against 11 Donkey Kongs, which is... Uh, I don't want to remember that. So, I figured, you know what, it's been a long time, and I realize it's also been a while since I did any videos. And don't worry guys, I know a lot of people are asking me about Ordinary Girl, I, I promise you I'm going to get that out very soon. Uh, and of course I'm still working on the Season 3 video for Loud House, just like, it's not easy reviewing like 40 plus episodes of a season that's... Well, I'll talk about that when I actually make the video. But for now, I figured I might as well play some games. So I'm going to be playing Crash Team Racing. And of course, the main reason I'm playing this game in particular is because of the Crash Team Racing remake that's coming out in a few days. I've already pre-ordered it. I'm very excited for it. I'm most likely going to do some gameplays on that as well. But only time will tell because that's going to have online gameplay. I'm super excited. But yeah, so for now, we're going to be playing some Crash Team Racing. So... Let's get to it. So I'm going to be picking hard because you guys love seeing me getting through the hardest shit. So I'm doing this for you guys. Oh man, it's been a very long time since I've played this. So hopefully I'm very good at it. Because cause, like, when you haven't played something in so long, you tend to get a little bit rusty at it. But yeah. And in case you guys are wondering how I'm recording this right now... What I thought was, I was originally going to be recording this game off of my original PlayStation 1 console, but the image quality looked like crap. I'm using like an AV to HDMI converter, but that looked like absolute crap, so I decided not to go through with it. And I was also originally going to record it on my PlayStation Classic, but the rendering on that one is just terrible. I, I suppose it's just another sign of showing that... The PlayStation Classic was a lazy console because Sony put, they didn't even put any effort into it. But anyway, so I'm actually, so right now, what you're seeing is I'm recording this off of an emulator, the EPSXE emulator. I'm not breaking any rules here because I do own the game. I actually own the game uh, on two devices. I own it physically on my PlayStation 1 console and I also own it digitally on PlayStation 3, so... I technically had to buy the game twice, so I'm not breaking any rules here. Uh, and of course, this is the NTS, this is the NTSC version because I prefer the 60 hertz gameplay because my version is obviously the PAL version because I live in Australia. Enough talking, I gotta focus right now. So, oh crap! Oh god! Okay, that almost fucked me up. I don't even know where that came from. Like I didn't see any potions on the road. Uh, anyway, so. I figured since we're talking about gaming, I might as well talk about some stuff that happened at E3. So, I didn't watch the Microsoft's one, although I did hear about the new Xbox console. So, yeah, I don't know. I guess you guys, I guess you Xbox guys will probably be excited about that. I couldn't really care less. But, but I, of course, was mostly focused on Nintendo. But even their press conference, well, their direct disappointed me because it was mostly just a bunch of, oh, hey, look, we got this game coming out and this and this and this. There were a few exceptions, though. Of course, I saw that Spyro is coming to Switch, which gives me a good excuse to actually record it. I might actually do a walkthrough on some point. Actually, that's one thing I've been thinking about for the past few weeks, or months, I should say. I've been wanting to do, like, an actual walkthrough, like, a any percent walkthrough, or maybe even, like, a 100% walkthrough, but I'm not sure what it's gonna be yet. I'm still looking for some suggestions on what I should record, because, you know, I've never actually done a walkthrough before, so that would actually be really fun to do. Anyway, so we're actually on the third lap right now. And I'm... Oh, fuck. Uh, everybody is way behind, so... Even though this is on the hardest difficulty. But yeah, like I say, Crash Team Racing is one of my favorite kart races. Like, I'd say it's probably the best kart racer of its generation. Because, I mean, what else did we have in that time? We had... We had Diddy Kong Racing and we had Mario Kart 64. I think I'll talk more about that when I actually get to the next race, because I got first place. And as you can clearly see, yes, it is an emulator. I apologize, it doesn't look the greatest, but 
it's still better than how it looks on the PlayStation Classic because if you've ever played Crash Team Racing on that with it hacked, trust me, it looks like absolute shit. So don't even bother. It was better than doing it on that anyway. Uh, I'm actually a little bit rusty with this track in particular. I haven't played it all that much, but hopefully I can make some progress. So as I was saying in my in the so as I was saying in the last race, uh, what other games did we have in this generation of Crash Team Racing? We had Mario Kart 64. Oh God, tiny! <laughs> oh my God, I love the I love the voice acting in this game. But yeah, the other games we had at that generation were Mario Kart 64 and Diddy Kong Racing. Now, I like Diddy Kong Racing, but I don't like Mario Kart 64. I think I've made that perfectly clear. I'm just not a fan of the game. I've never been able to enjoy it. And of course, that's mostly when we talk about the single player. I mean, the multiplayer is fine, but when it comes to a general kart race, I prefer Crash Team Racing. Oh my god, everyone's just catching up to me. How are they going faster than me? They're not even using any items. Fuck, man. Yeah, the CPU are way more aggressive here than they are in normal races. Damn it, I was so close. I got 10 Wumper Fruit. Give me something good game. Come on. That's not going to do shit. All it is is going to get me a little faster. Fucking hell, Coco, get your fucking ass back here. Unless you want to get squashed, god damn it. Give me it. Yes! Yeah, what was that? Here you go? Yeah, that's for you. Alright, come on. Come on, Crash. You're, you're like a balanced character, you gotta do something. How do they keep catching up to me? I'm not doing enough drifting, is that the problem? Oh, fuck! You fucking bitch! Oh, I lost my Wampa Fruit. Fuck you, Coco. Bitch. Never playing as you in this game. Ah! No! You bitch. Yes! Haha. -ha. Suck it. Come on, Crash. These CPU were relentless. They're always getting faster. Where is Dingle Dial? I didn't see him. Where is he? Oh my god, I'm freaking out. I literally have no idea who's behind me. Oh wait, they're all back there. Never mind. I actually have a chance of winning this. And that was very luck-based. Come on, give me that first place victory! Yes! By the way, in case you guys are wondering, yes, I'm actually using a controller, even though I'm playing this on an emulator, because playing with a controller is just better than using a bloody keyboard. So, yeah, this is a wired PS3 controller that I'm using. Uh, but of course, I like to use DualShocks on a PlayStation emulator. There is actually one key to winning this race in particular, but you know what? I'm not going to do it because it's kind of cheating. So, you know what? I'm just not going to do it. Because that'd be too easy for me. Damn it, Coco again! Go away. Oh no, fuck! That's so stupid. What? How did Tiny get in first? I didn't see him in the race. Oh, I'm really tempted to do that bloody shortcut, but I'm not gonna do it. Ah, uh, come on. Move out of the way. This is a hectic car racer, if you couldn't tell. Oh god, don't fall off. I'd hate to fall off and be so far behind the track. Give me the blue thingy. I don't know what it's called, but give me that item. Please, give me the blue thing. Damn it! Give me the box. I need the box. So then I can get more Wampa Fruits and increase my items. Oh yes, three- No! Let's say don't fall off, Crash. Oh my god, Tiny. You are to squish the puny cards. No, it's not. Cortex, shut up. 
Come on. Come on, Coco. Come here. Surprise! Here's another one. You're welcome. <laughs> this reminds me of when I'm playing against Donkey Kong. He's a freaking bitch. Oh god! What the fuck? You stupid whore. Give me the fucking blue thing. Cause doesn't that hit like everyone? Yes, the Buddha Buga. Come on, come here. First place is mine. What did Kokodex say? The trophy's mine. Oh man, that was close. Oh, alright. So one last race to go and hopefully I manage actually I got first place in all the all the races, so let's see if I can keep that streak going. I mean I don't know if I'll get first. I probably will get first, because I noticed I had twenty-seven points, I think it was twenty-seven. Everybody else had like six points. Cause everyone else had uh six points. Well, some people had six points, but I had twelve. No, no, not 12. 27, I think. I'm pretty sure it was 27. But this track in particular was the most noticeable with the bad graphics on the PlayStation Classic. The rendering is just terrible. Like, I would show a screenshot, but I don't actually have the game on the Classic anymore. So if you want to see it for yourself, go right ahead. I will not stop you, but it looks terrible. Oh my god, I hate getting on the grass. So yeah, like I said, I was still thinking of a game to walk through. I'm not sure what it will be yet, but I am I'm trying to find something to do a walkthrough on. Hopefully it's something that... I really want it to be something I've never played before, because to be honest, most of the games that I've been recording on this channel have all been games that I've actually already played, so playing a game I've never played before would actually be kind of fun. And of course, Super Mario Maker 2 is coming out in a few weeks, and I'm definitely getting that. I already have it pre-ordered. I'm super excited. I'm definitely going to be making some levels for Cleave. Although I think the I think the videos I record for Mario Maker 2 will more so be the levels that I actually play, not really what I make. Like I may show them what I'm doing on Twitter, but not on YouTube because it's all about playing. That's it's called a let's play, not a let's make. <laughs> Oh, that was a terrible joke. Alright. Anyway, I think we're almost at the finish line, I'm pretty sure. Nope, it's all the way over there. I just saw it. A brief summary of the white thing. A brief glimpse, I should say. Sometimes I get my words mixed up. So this is actually, this is actually a lot more relaxing to play than fucking Mario Kart, because at least I don't have to worry about Donkey Kong. And that's ensured a first place victory. <laughs> He's crying. Ooh, it was so funny. I love how Coco's just kind of like casually just on her laptop, not really caring if she lost or whatnot. But Cortex is just like, oh, I lost the Crash Bandicoot. I could probably do a better Cortex impression. But yeah, that was Crash Team Racing. Cleve, I know you don't like this game, but I don't care. Fuck you. This is a million times better than Mario Kart 64. I will never like that game, even if it's got Yoshi in it. Anyway, yeah, that's Crash Team Racing. I will get to doing the Crash Nitro Kart video at some point. I'll probably do it before Crash Team Racing Nitro Fuel comes out. But yeah, that's going to do for this video, guys. So thank you so much for watching. And until next time, keep on playing.